Welcome back, everybody. This weekend is the 24th annual Goleta Lemon Festival. It's yes. always one of the best events of the year. And as we move along here, we're going to share with you the festival is filled with activities, entertainment, good for the whole family. That's right. Don't forget the mouth-watering lemon-inspired food. The festival is all weekend long and starts tomorrow at 10 in the morning at Gersh Park in Goleta. This morning we have Hallie Ovolio. She is the chair of the festival. <laughs> With us this morning, Joe, I want to throw this at you. Yeah, we are we are limited out today. We are so ready. And this is one of the better festivals in our area. Absolutely. Tell us what we can expect. It's going to be a great festival. We expect thousands of people to be there at Gersh Park. Yeah. We've got tons of activities. And this year, one great new thing we're doing is activity wristbands for the kids. Okay. So parents can purchase a wristband, and then their kids can run wild and participate in almost all the activities. Uh, one great new thing we have this year is a zip line. So oh, oh, oh. kids and adults alike can soar across. Gersh Park on a zip line, so that'll be a lot of fun. How fun. Yeah. And you know, one of the things that highlights, of course, is the amazing food. So yes. everything lemon. Talk to me about <laughs> some of the creative uh, things that we might be able to see. Well, we have to give a big shout out to Anna's Bakery, who makes over 1,700 pies wow. for the festival. Wow. So that is incredible. Um, of course, there's lemon bars, lemon ice, lemon lemonade, lemon cotton candy, lemon wow. everything. So okay. the food is fantastic. One of my favorites is the lemon beer that is made. Yes. We were just talking about that. Right. One of the perks of working there is you right. can fill it One up whenever you like. One of my favorites as well. What, tell me a little bit about that. Well, Hollister Brew Co. makes a special lemon ale that they only make for the Lemon Festival, so we'll be serving that all weekend. So you can come by the beer booth and get some lemon ale and watch TV that's put on by Cox Media. How okay. fun. What did you bring here today? We brought some lemon bars that will also be at the oh, festival from Anna's Bakery. They do. They smell so good. Also, oh, the uh, Hollister Brew Co. Lemon Ale. And you can get a Mason Jar, commemorative Mason Jar for the Lemon Festival yeah, if you're so interested here. in doing so to drink your beer from. And you know, talking is, this, about. is this free? Are there tickets? Uh, how does That's that... a great question. Thank you. It's free admission, mm -hmm. um, so everybody's welcome. The only thing you have to pay for is food and activities, but there's great entertainment, free all weekend. Tons of booths, vendors, people, you know, buying things. Nonprofits are there to display. It's one of our biggest opportunities to let the nonprofits in the community come out and display, um, speak to the community, and tell us what they're all about and what their mission is. So this is in Gersh Park this weekend. Yep. Give us the details again, when it is, what time, and where people can park, maybe most importantly. Okay, perfect. Perfect. So Gersh Park in Goleta, right across the street from that Costco Camino yeah. Real Center. Yeah. Free admission, Saturday 10 to 6 and Sunday 10 to 5. Parking is kind of a free-for-all, so there's street parking available. We will have people helping direct parking, okay. so hopefully people will be able to find parking in the lots on Phelps and also in the neighborhoods. Hallie, thank you so much. Such a popular event. Thank you. Great. It's year great. After year, there's so many 24th more people 24th annual, right too. Yeah, it's awesome. <laughs> Pretty neat. We right. look forward to it. Thank you so much. Thank you so much for joining us. We'll be back in a couple minutes.